first down if he doesn't chase it down from behind. This is a high punt that they'll try to pooch and get it inside the 20. It hits at the five and is down there. 37 of his 76 punts have been downed inside the 20 this year. He's the best at it. A 36 yard punt. 14 nothing Buckeyes. B.J. Sander has just pinned the Wildcats inside the five. So far, L. Roberson has not found his rhythm. He is really struggling. Buckeyes show blitz. They bring it off the corner. Roberson beats it, but it's intercepted. Picked off by Chris Gamble. James Terry did not get the audible. Roberson saw pressure coming from the outside. He called an audible. And James Terry did not get it. He went to run a fade. Gamble peaked a little bit playing man in man coverage. Terry's supposed to break this off, does not. And Gamble, boy, that's a big risk, but it paid off. You're playing one on one, still peeking back into the end zone. No wonder his last name is what it is. So Ohio State showed blitz. L. Roberson read it. James and his Terry receiver did not. did not. No, he did not. And you saw Roberson pull back away from the line of scrimmage because Ohio State showed the blitz early to that weak side. He came off of what was called to get another route call, and James Terry continued with the old route. Look out, boys. Here come the Buckeyes. It's almost time to batten down the hatches. Touchdown, Jenkins. Ohio State's on a roll. A 17-yard strike. Prenzel to Jenkins, set up by the interception by Roberson. You know who's loving this right now? USC. Team that ran all over Oklahoma, getting trounced early by Ohio State. It helps their argument a lot, doesn't it? Nugent's extra point attempt splits the sticks. And with 6.49 to play in the first half, the defending national champions, 21. The Big 12 champions, nothing. Krenzel to Jenkins, making a statement. 